In his presentation, Representative Tajdin Adekunle said the federal government has spent billions of naira for training of ex-militants in various fields with little or nothing to show. He said reports of embezzlement have been trailing after the management of the presidential amnesty program. In the proclamation of the amnesty program, the federal government has spent a lot of resources in training many youths of the area, both locally and internationally. The recent, the federal government paid the sum of 8.5 billion naira into the presidential amnesty program, TSA account, for the execution of this lofty idea. Concerned by the media report, an outcry of masses looting at the Kayama Amnesty Center between 14th and 16th February 2019. The House unanimously agreed that there is need to ascertain the authenticity of the allegations. Where security agents, the coordinator of the center, and unknown person were alleged to have carted away equipment worth billions of naira in the Starter Park warehouse allegedly to the knowledge of the special advisor on amnesty to the president. Also concerned about media reports of massive corruption and out, outright embezzlement of funds meant for the execution of the program, program's objective. Hence, it has become imperative to investigate these allegations for the good of the Niger Delta people and the nations at large. The House therefore resolved to set up an ad hoc committee to investigate the matter for further legislative action. Charity Tanko, ITV News, Abuja.